welcome back to my channel impart math knowledge this is the continuation of previous video here the discussion is about arithmetic progression ap is a sequence of numbers that has a fixed common difference between any two consecutive numbers for cubic equation the roots are a minus d a a plus d S1 sum of the roots taken one at a time, S2 sum of the roots taken two at a time, S3 product of the roots. For fourth degree equation, the roots are a minus 3d, a minus d, a plus d, a plus 3d. S1 sum of the roots taken one at a time, S2 sum of the roots taken two at a time, S3 sum of the roots taken three at a time, S4 product of the roots. The problem is solve 4x cube minus 24x square plus 23x plus 18 is equal to 0 whose roots are in arithmetic progression. Here the given problem is a cubic equation so it has three roots. The given condition is the roots are of AP form. So we can assume the roots are a minus d a a plus d. From the given problem, the coefficient of x cube is 4. So, a naught is equal to 4. Coefficient of x square is minus 24. a1 is minus 24. Coefficient of x is 23. So, a2 is 23. Constant term is 18. Now, sum of the roots taken one at a time is a minus d, a, a plus d is equal to minus a1 by a0. So, 3a is equal to minus a1 by a0. a1 is minus 24. a0 is 4. So, 3a is equal to 24 by 4. That is 3a is equal to 6. So, a is equal to 2. Now we need to find the value for d. For that you take the product of the roots. S3 the product of the roots a minus d a a plus d is equal to minus a3 by a0. a minus d a plus d are of the form a square minus d square. So a square minus d square a is equal to minus a3 is 18 and A0 is 4. Here A value is 2. So 2 square minus D 2 is equal to minus 18 by 4. 4 minus D square is equal to minus 18 by 4 into 2. So 4 minus D square is equal to minus 9 by 4 minus d square is equal to minus 9 by 4 minus 4 taking lcm minus d square is equal to minus 9 minus 16 by 4 minus d square is equal to minus 25 by 4 cancelling the negative sign so d square is equal to 25 by 4 d is equal to plus or minus 5 by 2. Case 1 a is equal to 2 and d is equal to 5 by 2 and case 2 a is equal to 2 d is equal to minus 5 by 2. a value is 2 so 2 minus 5 by 2 2 2 plus 5 by 2 2 minus of minus 5 by 2 2 2 minus 5 by 2 Taking LCM, we get 4 minus 5 by 2, 2, 4 plus 5 by 2, 4 plus 5 by 2, 2, 4 minus 5 by 2, minus 1 by 2, 2, 9 by 2. Here also you will get the same value, 9 by 2, 2, minus 1 by 2. 
So the roots are minus 1 by 2, 2 and 9 by 2. For cubic equation, the roots are AP form means assume that A minus D, A and A plus D are roots. First find sum of the roots taken one at a time, then product of the roots. From that you can get A and D value. Next problem is a fourth degree equation. The condition is the roots are of AP form. So we assume that the roots are A minus 3D, A minus D, A plus D, and A plus 3D. Let the roots be a minus 3D, A minus D, A plus D, A plus 3D. From the given equation, A naught is 1, A1 is minus 8, A2 14, A3 8 and A4 is minus 15. A naught is equal to 1, A1 is minus 8, A2 14, A3 8 a4 minus 15 find a value from sum of the roots taken one at a time and d value from product of the roots sum of the roots taken one at a time a minus 3d plus a plus d plus a minus d plus a plus 3d is equal to minus a1 by a naught minus 3d plus 3d getting cancelled plus d minus d getting cancelled 4a is equal to minus a1 by a0 a1 is minus 8 so minus of minus 8 by a0 is 1 4a is equal to 8 so a value is 2 Find D value from product of the roots. Product of the roots A4 by A0. That is A minus 3D. A minus D. A plus D. A plus 3D. A4 value is minus 15. A0 is 1. A minus 3D. A plus 3D is of the form A square minus B square. So, we can write that as a square minus 9d square. a minus d, a plus d can be written as a square minus d square. Right hand side is minus 15. a value is 2. So, we replace a by 2, 2 square, 9d square, 2 square, d square. Multiplying this we get 4 into 4, 16, minus 4 into minus d square, 4 d square, 4 into 4 is 16, 4 into minus d square, so minus 4 d square, minus 9 d square into 4 is minus 36 d square, minus 9 d square, minus d square is plus 9 d to the power 4, right hand side, minus 15. Highest power is 4, so 9d to the power 4 minus 40d square plus 16 plus 15 is equal to 0. 9d to the power 4 minus 40d square plus 31 is equal to 0. This is a biquadratic equation. So we can find d square from the formula minus b plus r minus b square minus 4ac by 2a. a is equal to 9, b is equal to minus 40 and c is equal to 31. Substitute in the formula d square is equal to minus of minus 40 plus r minus minus 40 square minus 4 into a value is 9 and c value is 31 whole thing divided by 2 into 9 d square is equal to minus into minus is plus plus 40 
plus or minus 40 square is 1600 4 into 9 into 31 is triple 16 whole thing divided by 18 so d square is equal to 40 plus or minus root of 484 by 18 root of 484 is 22 40 plus 22 by 18 40 minus 22 by 18 so d square is equal to 31 by 9 comma 1 one root is fraction another one is a whole number so we consider 1 d square is equal to 1 so d is equal to plus or minus 1 case 1 a value is 2 d value is 1 and case 2 a value is 2 and d value is minus 1 Roots are of the form a minus 3d, a minus d, a plus d and a plus 3d. If a is equal to 2 and d is equal to 1, the roots are minus 1, 1, 3, 5. If a is equal to 2 and d is equal to minus 1, the roots are 5, 3, 1 and minus 1. So the roots for the given equation is minus 1, 1, 3, 5. The next one, find the condition that the roots of the equation x cube plus px square plus qx plus r is equal to 0 may be in arithmetic progression. The given equation is a cubic equation. So the roots are a minus d, a, a plus d. Here a naught is equal to 1, a1 is p and a2 is q. And A3 is R. Sum of the roots taken one at a time is A minus D, A, A plus D is equal to minus A1 by A0. Minus D plus D getting cancelled. 3A is equal to minus A1 is P and A0 is 1. A is equal to minus P by 3. A is the root of the given equation. So, we put x is equal to minus p by 3. Put x is equal to minus p by 3 in the given equation. The equation is x cubed plus px square plus qx plus r is equal to 0. x is equal to minus p by 3. P minus p by 3 square plus q minus p by 3 plus r is equal to 0 minus p q by 27 plus p q by 9 minus p q by 3 plus r is equal to 0 taking LCM minus p cube 9 into 3 is 27 so 3 p cube minus 3 into 9 is 27 so 9 p cube plus 27 r is equal to 0 minus p cube plus 3 p cube is 2 p cube minus 9 p cube plus 27 r is equal to 0. When 27 goes to right hand side, it becomes 0. This is the required condition for the given problem. For finding the roots of the arithmetic progression, first you write the root, then find A and D using sum of the roots taken one at a time and product of the roots. Hope you all understand. Thank you for watching.